I did not know this, but it is Michigan's single largest art festival. That's that's a big uh, title, considering we have so many art festivals. Plymouth Art in the Park. There is the, the the whole Plymouth though. I like it didn't go for years, and all of a sudden I went for the first time, probably about three weeks ago. Loved the town. You felt like Dorothy in uh, yeah. uh, yes, so absolutely in the uh, Wonderland. Jay Towers, the birds are chirping behind you. Yeah, what's, what's going on there? So listen. This is interesting. This is Tammy. She's from South Lyon. And these aren't your average birds. Now, you know, guys, I typically, if you tell me to do something, I'll go in and do it. I don't care. You know, we <laughs> have the Howell Nature people in all the time. But I, I, this one I wasn't crazed about because they really love people, which is nice. But Tammy, tell me about these unique birds. These are lorikeets. They're native to Australia. They um, eat mainly nectar and pollen, and so people can come in here with little cups of nectar, and the birds will land on them, and they can feed them. And they just and and, and they just land on your head though, with no problem, right? They they yeah. they, they just they go anywhere they want to go. All right, so let me see a feed here. Are they not super hungry? <laughs> well, I've been feeding them for just a minute here. All right. <laughs> Here's one here. Okay. So do you mind you mind when these birds? Because I was watching a little while ago. Did you mind when the birds land on your head? No. You're used to it. You like it? Yeah. Do they ever, you know, have accidents in there? We call it accident. We call them accidents. They do have little accidents. All right. <laughs> <laughs> That's supposed to be good luck. Sometimes they have little accidents. So you w explain to me when you said in Australia these are called nuisance birds, right? Yeah. Why? Because they can go to like a peach grove and they just eat all of the um, peaches or any kind of fruit and take them out. So, I mean, obviously you're not going to find these birds here in our country unless you bring them here, right? Right. Yeah. Yeah. They have a little brush on the tip of their tongue that sucks up the nectar and pollen. Tell me about Carousel Acres. Carousel Acres in South Lyon, and we do animal exhibits. We have petting farm, pony rides, the lorikeets, and we have reindeer, a butterfly house also. <laughs> okay. Hey, Jay. Nice. And uh, hey, Jay. Yes. You, yes. Know, you look totally uncomfortable no. with these birds, by the way. You do, do, do you not like the birds? N no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. We thought it'd be fun if you went inside with the birds. Yeah, hang out with them. Be one with the birds. That's great, Dina. And I think uh, for our next segment, we're going to have a vehicle come and get you. And we'll take you out to Plymouth, and I'm going to put you in there with your nice hair, and it'll all be puffed up in the this back. Would be a, good this, luck, good this would luck be charms all over your hair. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, all right. Hey, Look, yes. real quick, Art in the Park. It happens today, 10 to 7 and 10 to 5 tomorrow. I want to give you the hours at myfoxytruth.com if you want to come out here. Thank you, Tammy. See you guys. Look at the, look at the birds. Isn't that wild? Just sit right on that guy. No accidents. No accidents. <laughs> Goodbye. It was just a suggestion. <laughs> and my hair, look, this would be a great nest, wouldn't it? It would be wonderful. Uh, some other great events going on in Metro Detroit. This